What is going on everybody, Eric the Electric coming back to you guys again, My Electric Empire with another video. Ladies and gentlemen, I am so excited to bring you guys this video because it's been quite some time since I've tried to take on an entire menu at a fast food establishment. Granted, today's video, it's not gonna be at a fast food establishment. It's gonna be somewhere delicious. Costco. Costco is giant here in America. Costco sells everything. Giant cereal, giant bags of coffee, giant jars of peanut butter. But most importantly, everyone, they have an amazing food court. Costco's food court is legendary. You guys can get pizza, you guys can get salads, if you're into that sort of thing. You can get chicken bakes, you can get froyo, and you can even get delicious sandwiches. The last time I did an entire menu challenge, I went to In-N-Out, I hung out with JP and Julia from Healthy Junk Food, and you know what, everyone? It's time to do it again. So without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, members of the Electric Empire, it's time for the entire Costco menu challenge. Let's do this. Alrighty, everyone. So just so you all know, Costco gets a little bit busy. So I'm gonna I'm pre-order it. Hopefully they answer. Hi there. So I'm gonna do one entire pepperoni pizza, please, and then one chicken Caesar salad, two churros, okay, two chicken bakes, and then two turkey and provolone sandwiches, please. And then do you guys right. do you guys have your beef briskets? No. No. No, we don't. Okay, but you guys have hot dogs too, right? Yep. Okay, so then let's do, I'll do two hot dogs. Okay. One acai bowl. I'll do one froyo. Uh-huh. And then uh, two Diet Cokes. And then, uh, is there anything else on the menu that I missed? Covered it. You got it. You covered your bases there. It's 4228. Okay. All right, we'll see you in a little bit then. Perfect. Thank you so much. Whew. So we got everything ordered. Now, we got to get the essentials first. Mm -hmm. Essentials time. Not that many essentials though, because we pretty much got everything. Health and fitness. If only this was a supercharged menu challenge. No bonus rounds in this video though. That was very rude. Alrighty guys, we got the goods. Now it's time to get the real goods. Mm -hmm. And we're here at Costco, people. It's time to get our food. I just had a pickup order for Eric. For Eric? Oh, you had like the one of them. Yeah, I pretty much one of everything. What was it exactly? Pepperoni pizza, acai bowl, two uh, turkey provolone sandwiches. I wanted to add in another one though. All right, 5196. Okay. Yeah. All right, thanks a lot, man. Thank you so much. Yeah. Gotta get our diet drinks. Diet Pepsi. What happened for you? I'm trying to say, do I need a caffeine free or something? Oh, babe, it smells amazing. Now it smells so good. Do you want some of this? Nope. When are, when are we going to do a food challenge together? Don't even give anybody any ideas. All right, everybody. We have our Costco. We have our delicious food. It's time to get this home and get this all presentable. Mm -hmm. All right, everybody. We have our Costco right here, guys. I'm so excited to get into this one, guys. Oh, my goodness. I love Costco pizza. It's so good. I'm going to show you guys that in just one second. But I just want to say I hope you guys are having an amazing day whenever you guys are seeing this. I've been wanting to do this challenge for so long now. And I'm surprised that it took me this long to finally do a Costco challenge. Comment down below with what your favorite thing is to get at the Costco food court, guys. Because they actually have pretty decent food for the price. So let me know down in the comments below. We have our small bag of essentials right here. I did say in the store that bonus rounds are reserved strictly for supercharged mini challenges and I want you guys to know that I'm not a liar, but I did lie there because I got some uh, some additional items I feel like would make a really good dessert for this. So we're gonna leave those over there though. So you guys gotta stick around to the end of the video. Don't click out, don't click off the video. Don't skip my ads too, even though you can if you want. Whatever. We got some diet A&W over here. We have some cashew milk just in case I need it. You guys know Cashew milk really helps, even though it did not help in last week's gummy challenge that I epically failed. Sorry about that. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that one. I also have my frozen yogurt and my acai bowl in the freezer because I don't want them to melt. All right, guys, let's start unpackaging all this. Let's get this all presentable, people, all right? Toodles. These are the turkey provolone sandwiches right here. I love turkey provolone sandwiches. And they got like 730 calories in each of them, 740, something like that. And then we got three of them right there. And then right here we have chicken bakes, people. Let me just tell you all right now, okay? When I first bit into a chicken bake, I had to have been eight years old. And as an eight-year-old kid, I... I lost my mind, okay? My life was changed. I bit into that chicken bake. You guys get it, it's amazing, all right? If you guys don't know what a chicken bake is, I'm gonna I'm put it right there. You guys can take a gander for yourself what a chicken bake looks like, and I'm assuming these are the hot dogs right there. And you guys know my stance on hot dogs. I'm not a big fan of hot dogs. And you guys know we had to get our greens in, people. I gotta get my, my vitamins in, okay? With all this, you know, cheese and fat and grease. So I got a salad. All right, guys, and here we are. Get ready for it. Let's do this electric empire. Woo! Look at that, people. Oh my goodness gracious, it looks sensational. There's just something about pizza that just gets me so excited, all right? And it's so good because it does not have pineapple on it. I'll say it a million times. You guys should know my stance on pineapple on pizza. It just does not belong, but pepperoni certainly does belong. You guys gotta comment down below what your favorite pizza topping is. Let me know. 
put that right there. Oh my gosh. Oh, it looks so good. Anyways, guys, I gotta get the frozen items out just to show you guys what they look like. One second. Frozen yogurt. I got vanilla because vanilla is just better than everything else. And the last item, everyone, I don't expect you guys to know what it is, but here in Southern California, these things are pretty popular, all right? An acai bowl is something you will undoubtedly enjoy. And look at that, people. We got some fresh granola. We have some other blueberries in there, too. Acai bowls are amazing, guys. And I think it's pretty much just like ground up frozen pomegranate seeds. Whatever. It tastes like you're drinking a smoothie. It's amazing. I'm so excited for this, everyone. Just to capture my excitement, I got to inform Instagram and Snapchat what I'm doing right now. If you guys haven't yet, you guys got to follow me on Instagram and Snapchat. They get the sneak peeks first. Snapchat crew. Nice video, everybody. I had that on the whole time. Jeez, that's gross. Like I said, guys, follow me on Instagram and Snapchat if you haven't already. And speaking of social media, I gotta let you guys know that I'm also on Cameo now. If you, a friend, a family member, anyone wants a personalized shout out, you guys can go to my Cameo page, check me out there. You basically go on the page, let me know whatever you want me to shout out, and I'll send you a nice little shout out. So you guys can check that out down below. It'll be linked down in the description. Now, Electric Empire, we're at the point of the video where I gotta let you guys know the total calories and total macros for this entire challenge. Total calories, those are gonna be listed like right there for you guys. And total macros, that means protein, carbs, fat. Those are gonna be listed like right there for you guys. Without further ado, my friends, my family, members of the Electric Empire, this is the entire Costco menu challenge. Let's do this. It was terrible. Alrighty, everybody. Man, that thumbnail took forever to take, but you know what it is. What it is, guys. You gotta do the YouTube stuff, get that done first. Now it's time to feast. Before every challenge, you guys know, you gotta give the video a like if you poop today. Good news, I did. I have my Dragon Ball Z cup. Gotta summon the power of Goku for this challenge. I also got some ranch right here, just in case we need it. I'm not saying I'm gonna use it, but I'm probably gonna use it. Oh, and how can I forget? We have our frozen stuff to get, too. Let's do this acai first. We gotta get some fruit in today. I also have my spoon of peas right here because it just feels weird using a normal spoon when I do food challenges now. So yeah, we're gonna use this one. Nothing like a good bowl of health and fitness to start off the Costco challenge full of grease, fat, salt, and carbs. That's the perfect time for me to say fitness. Fitness whole acai bowl in my mouth, even though this is not the whole bowl. Let's do this challenge. Guys, I was gonna say after that 45 mile bike ride today, this is definitely fire. Let's do this, people. Goodness, you guys don't know how good that tastes, actually. I gotta say, guys, I've never had this from Costco before, but they certainly did it right. All right, guys, acai bowl is down. Absolutely delicious. Oh, I feel so healthy now. <laughs> All right, let's see how this frozen yogurt tastes. I mean, it's not ice cream, it's yogurt, so I mean, technically it's healthy, right? Oh, goodness gracious, I forgot how good that was. That's double fire, man. Oh, goodness gracious, that's amazing. Alrighty, guys, so the frozen yogurt is down. Goodness gracious. Now we have tons of different options to choose from, ladies and gentlemen. It's like Christmas, literally. You don't know whether to go with pizza, hot dogs, hot turkey provolone sandwiches, these amazing works of art, which are chicken bakes, which are amazing. Oh my goodness gracious. God, I gotta do the chicken bake right now. This is absolutely sensational. Earlier, I asked you guys what your favorite Costco items are, and I gotta say, this one's mine. You're about to see why. Look at this work of art. You have bacon and chicken on the inside. Look at that. Oh my goodness. I've been eating these all my life, and I will always eat them. They are that amazing. W-O-W -W moment. Oh my goodness. Tastes amazing every single time I bite into one. Seriously amazing. But everyone, what could make it better? What could possibly make it better? You guys already knew where I was going, you know. You gotta, actually I should do that. Not over the churro. Yeah, there we go. It's gonna try to do that move where I don't look at the food. I just look at you guys while I'm pouring the ranch and sometimes it just doesn't work out the way I want it to. But here we go. All right guys, well, almost all of our chicken bakes are down even though, yeah, almost all of them are down. Let's see how their Diet Pepsi tastes. Flat, whatever. I'm just gonna pretend like that doesn't exist. Alrighty, guys, so all the chicken bakes are down. Now it's time to get in these hot dogs. Let's see how these wieners taste. Stupid joke, sorry. Taste just like hot dogs. Hot dogs can always be made better with ketchup and ranch. And don't even get me started on mustard, okay? Let me know down below what your favorite 
condiments are if you do eat hot dogs, okay? I will eat hot dogs if they have ranch on them and ketchup. That's it. Don't even get me started with that disgusting relish stuff. Mm. You guys know if you watch my Sonic Supercharged Meat Challenge, obviously. All right, guys, so our hot dogs are all down. So far, guys, it's going absolutely amazing. Honestly, guys, I love Costco food. Costco food is great. And uh, I'm just glad we, we went here and we started here, even though the Cokes are flat. That's totally fine. We're doing good so far. I think, guys, it's time to move on to our pizza. Fun fact, everyone, Electric Empire, out of all the fast food pizza conquests that you guys have seen me do, the one from Costco is the biggest. Look at that, guys. Just look at it. 4,300 calories of greatness right there. I have not had Costco pizza in forever. Just Costco pizza, let's do it. Triple fire. Costco pizza, folks, that is where it's at. And I know what you guys are saying. I know what you guys are saying. You're going, Eric, why haven't you ranch rise the pizza yet? Eric is doing that right now. Don't worry. Oh, it's an exquisite specimen. Pizza that has been rancherized is pizza that is worthy of eating. There you are, people. Wow, that is a lot of pizza. Goodness gracious. All right, everyone. Our pizza, basically half of our pizza is left. And you know what, guys? I haven't done this in a few videos. I gotta show everybody on Snapchat some love. If you guys haven't already, like I said earlier, you guys can follow me on Instagram and also Snapchat too, and you guys just might be in a future video. <laughs> Goodness gracious. <laughs> Costco challenge, baby. W O W. You guys are awesome. Eric, loving your challenges and your YouTube channel. Do a W O W moment with the pizza and the yogurt. I would if if I hadn't already eaten the pizza and the yogurt, my man. Hey Eric. Oh. <laughs> Hi Eric, the electric. I love your videos and I hope you like the Costco pizza you're about to have. I've had it before. I thought it was pretty good. Pretty, pretty good. Costco pizza is amazing, all right? It's amazing, but I haven't even gotten started on Deep Dish yet. Wait until that 900,000 subscriber video comes out. It's gonna be a good one. It's been something I think you guys have been wanting to see for quite some time. Who can guess what's coming? Let me know down in the comments below. I love the vids, Eric. Make sure you like and subscribe down below and turn on those post notifications. Listen to the man. I actually think my last video, last few videos, YouTube hasn't even been sending out notifications and it's kind of been making me a little upset, okay? You guys get my notification. What's good, Eric? You about to kill this challenge. Hope this makes it in the video. My man Oliver has hit me with the positivity, guys. I love the positivity, folks. Positivity is great. You know, it's everything I need to succeed right there. Let me just put it that way. Love you guys. Let's do this. My friends, this is one heck of a pizza party. Just put it that way. Oh man, way more pizza than I need for sure. Even though I've eaten a lot of pizza in my life, not all the pizza, but goodness gracious. And to think I was actually contemplating doing a pizza overload instead of this challenge. If you guys want to see a pizza overload, let me know down in the comments. And actually, let me know what other overload challenges you guys want to see, because I, I already know what I'm doing next, but I, I want to know your desires for future overload challenges. Oh, oh my goodness, guys, that pizza was rather <clears throat> filling. Wow, it was denser than I thought it would be, but it's okay, we got the full pizza down. I'm not sure how many calories I'm at right now, but <clears throat> probably a lot. Now, guys, I think I gotta I gotta just get this, this salad down. It looks like a salad. Believe it or not, everyone, this salad Clocks in at 630 calories. To me, that's a little crazy. Not gonna lie. Chicken's good. This is a chicken Caesar salad. But that's not gonna happen. We got better than this. Ranch goes on everything, everybody. Ranch does go on everything. Not very good at tossing salads. Yes, I am eating salad with a spoon. Oh my goodness gracious, everybody. Glad I'm getting my veggies in today. Despite the fact you guys see me eat lots of calories and do food challenges on this channel, 
you guys gotta you guys gotta know it's very very important to get your veggies in all right get those fruits in veggies are delicious even though i i joke about them a lot veggies are probably 80 percent of my diet okay maybe not 80 percent but it's, it's a very big chunk of my diet when i'm not doing this all right cool our salad's down as you can see Thanks. now we have our sandwiches left our churros and plus more dessert get into these sandwiches right now turkey provolone tomatoes onions pretty sure there's like mayo on this too the sandwich is amazing i had it actually for the first time in my 30,000 calorie cheat day back in 2015 seems like forever ago Woo! w o w moment again amazing there's just something about these guys these sandwiches Look at it, people. You have turkey, provolone cheese. I just realized that this has pesto sauce on it too. Tomatoes, onions. Just wish this bread wasn't so thick right now. That pizza really was pretty dense. Oh. All right, guys. Well, maybe three sandwiches is way too much for me to get, but regardless, it's all been amazing so far. We have dessert, and oh, why are they all the way over there? Let's see. Oh. <clears throat> We also have other dessert, which is Hershey's Gold Bar. And believe it or not, these are the first Hershey's products I'm choosing to eat voluntarily after that Hershey's Overload Challenge. We also have the new Reese's Chocolate Lovers Cups. We gotta try one of these churros first. These things are absolutely amazing. And I just wanna say everyone, I am so glad that this is not a gummy churro or something like that. That would be terrible. Let's do this. Woo! That's why people fire. That's exactly what I need right now. Oh my goodness. Since I depleted all my water out of this cup, I'm now going to do something that I probably should have done a long time ago. And it's definitely necessary with this churro right here. Let's do this. Optimal dunking time for churro. It's unknown because I've actually never done this before, but it really helps get the rest of the food down a lot easier. Alrighty guys, while well, the churros are all done, let's see how this new Reese's tastes. It's probably not so new actually. Just like a regular Reese's. <sighs> and just like that Electric Empire, that has been another challenge. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the challenge. If you guys did enjoy the challenge, be sure to let me know down in the comments below. And also, let me know where you guys want me to go next time. And let me just tell you everybody, that was one of my favorite challenges I've actually ever done. There's so much variety. There's cheesiness from the pizza. There's sweetness from that acai bowl. Froyo. We got a salad. We got pretty much everything in this challenge, so I really enjoyed it. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Hit that notification bell, people, right next to that subscribe button so you guys get notified whenever a future upload happens. Follow me on my social media, Facebook, Snapchat, Twitter, Instagram. You know the drill. Thanks again for watching the video, everybody. 